Uh, Inkul... I don't know what the hell this is. Inkul and Nati. We'll try this. That's bright. Okay. Settings. Uh... Full screen off. Okay, so I guess I just can't. There's no window to full screen. Let's turn off screen shake. Fuck that. Hang on. There we go. Okie dokie. Academy. Uh, welcome to Ikalani. Start by exploring the Academy. That's where you'll learn how to play. All right. Basic lessons. Welcome. You are starting your first battle against the wild beasts. In a moment, you will learn how to fight them effectively. During the battle, you perform actions with your tiny and the beasts you have drawn. Let's start with your tiny, a tiny self-portrait of the real Ikolonati, who is sitting over the manuscript. If your tiny dies, you lose the battle. Okay. You can only draw beasts near your tiny. The range of each action you can perform is indicated by green dials. To draw a beast, you must spend ink. Above the beast icon, you can see how many drops of ink it requires. In the upper left-hand corner, next to the tiniest portrait, you can check how much ink you have. Okay. So, sword-wielding dog. I guess I'll put him here. He cost five. I'll move my camera down here, I guess. Hang on. Okay. All right, right after you draw a beast, they take a nap. This means they can't make a move until the next chapter. What is a chapter? It is a round during which the opponents take turns to move their beasts or tiny. Just like in chess, each beast and tiny moves only once in each chapter and the chapter ends when everyone has made their move. Okay. New beasts as well as units that have moved are snoozing. This means they can no longer move in this chapter. Your tiny is the last unit awakened and their turn thus ending the chapter. Okay. All right. Uh... So I see him sleeping. I see them sleeping. How do I end turn? Or maybe I spawn another one? Double dog? Okay, double dog. I gained three ink. Chapter two. Fuck, I need to move my cam again, I think. Go right here, I guess. Your opponent takes turns making moves. If you had the last move in the previous chapter, your opponent starts the new chapter. Unlike tinies, beasts can freely roam the battlefield. Each beast has different stats. However, the beast has seen basic info. Moving to a green field does not end the beast's turn. They can still perform an action, although it will no longer be possible to switch to a different beast. Any other action... Okay, got it. Moving to your yellow field or sprint range will end the beast's turn. The beast will take a nap. Uh... 
I can move here. Okay, once you've chosen an enemy to attack, target the enemy, confirm it. Swords only attack adjacent fields. If your target is not adjacent, move your beast again to attack. Got it. Okay, big damn. Ow. Okay, Dennis. Can I not move my character? I guess I can't. Strikes the selected target for five damage. <laughs> Bitch. Okay, chapter three. You can only move one piece of time at a time after performing an action. It's like you, you cannot switch to a different one. Okay, great. You attack this guy. I can kill him. I'm the best. Okay. Choose between move left and move right. The selected base for an enemy will move to the uncovered field. Okay. Push an enemy into the abyss and kill them instantly. Okay. Okay. Can he even do anything? Oh, they can throw stuff. <laughs> okay, it wants me to draw a beast. Uh... Where the fuck? How do I... I'm confused. How do I draw? Oh, I click that and I put that. How do I can't put this down here? So how do I do this in that case? Am I crazy? Okay, I'll spawn him here. I guess he can move down. I don't know. I might have just fucked up the tutorial. Alright, now I'm just gonna start sliding, I guess. I don't know. Oh! Push. Okay, take a nap. Fuck it. Go to sleep, bro.
Fuck. <laughs> can I not push this guy? Oh, I guess I can't. I should have spawned this dog up here with a misplay. Where the hell is the turn order? I guess I kind of see it. <laughs> okay. Apocalyptic fire? What? I right, just beat his ass. Next lesson. What? Huh? Are we cut sceneing right now? Two masters of the living ink, Inculinati, will duel on the margins of an ancient manuscript. This is your entire exam. For your entry exam, you'll be playing as Godfrey in a duel against Hildegard, the holy ch church reformer, okay? Sword attacks deal the most damage, although they can only target adjacent fields. Spear attacks can reach up two fields away or one level. Bow attacks can hit up to six fields away, except adjacent ones and beasts that use bows have the lowest amount of health, however. Okay. Well, bow wielding dog. I guess I'll put a sword guy here and start moving his ass. And then, how much ink do I have left? Okay, that's it then. Bow and sword. Let's shove him a little forward. And turn. Hey, Skippy. Alright, my turn. To draw beasts, you need ink. You can replenish your ink by ending your turn on ink blots. You will receive three drops of ink for your tiny and the... Uh... Okay, so I want to have... Okay, I see that. Great. I want to move this guy here. I'm thinking, hang on. Can I shoot? 
Attacks up to three targets up to six fields away. Or single target. Massive four. Blasted him. Okay, he walks up now. And then... Did I get extra ink for that? I think so, I got one ink. Nice. Uh, I don't have enough ink for anything, so I guess I just... Let's gain some ink. Massive seven. Uh, if you want to know if your opponent's beast is able to attack you, check its movement range. Okay. <sighs> Cleave. Attacks both fields at once can be used every two chapters. Okay, hits for five to seven, but there's only, I only need single target, so. Uh, if I hit for five, I'm in one shot. Oh. I'm timed. Ow. Motherfucker. Dennis. Oh my god. Let's summon pretty good range for a dog. How much does he have for? Three to five. He can walk more spaces though, so he's got speed. Let's summon a spearman just to see it. shove her into fire? Maybe I could have just shoved her off the map, honestly. Ow. This is the beginning of the end of the battle. At first, you'll see the field's going to be affected by blocks of the chapter, everything, including you, you're tiny. Okay. Oh, I can push them off the battlefield. Damn. No! I guess I start attacking this person. Give the target one level of Halo and makes them temporarily unpushable. some damage over here. Uh, fuck, just go to bed.
push her? Oh, I could have pushed her. You're right. I should have. What? No! You can double push me? Now we've got a problem. I shouldn't have pushed. Whoa. Actually, maybe that's good because I can double attack here. Oh, jeez. I gotta push myself. Summoning a second dog. Don't do that. Wow. Okay, I'm actually so bad. <laughs> Holy fuck. I lost the tutorial. Should have put the sword guy in front, whatever. Gonna shove myself up here. Uh, fuck. That's big damage. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna walk here. Yeah, 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 I see that. I guess I'm gonna walk here and go to bed because I can't do shit. Why can't I shove here? I'm confused. Well, I guess the range? Okay, so I can't shove people across the map. Alright, well, let's go to sleep then. Maybe shove myself here. And then go to bed. Okay, big damage here. More AoE. Wait, I did the wrong attack. Did I? I'm so confused. <laughs> I should I just summon two archers. What? <laughs> Didn't that have a skull next to it?
My archer. Hildegard's course for beginners, intermediate. Fuck it. Let's just play. New journey. Let's play on normal because I suck. Character? Alwife Miller. Andreas Damsel. Looney. I guess I'm Looney? Beasts. Hand actions. Halo. Talents. Enemy beasts can push your tiny. Fuck. Okay. So I basically I have a bow wielder, spear, and sword wielder, but I get to pick my fourth. A bish bishop. Mace user. Let's go bishop. Name. Idiot. Fuck. I D I O T. Color. Wow. Green. Next. All right. I'm gonna go pee. Okay. Okay. Today you will pass your final exam because blah, 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 it's a wild beast encounter. Okay. Change army. Okay, I don't have anything else. So. Every two to three chapters, random objects appear on the field. Every one of two, two chapters, a couple of ink blots will spawn. And it's apocalypse. On the fourth turn. All right, let's go. Who do I kill to win? I guess all of them? All right, let's summon a bowman right here, I guess. Excellent. Big ink gain. Well, now I don't get plus one ink because I moved that. All right. Ow. Bro, it's going through the entire tutorial again. What? Causes an enemy beast to take a nap? 
get a headache and lose accuracy this action won't work if the target is facing your beast is that an ass Okay, bow guy was a misplay for sure. I wonder if this cart blows up if I kill it. I don't know. Bishop can hit up to two fields away, can restore health and cure from all negative statuses by peering. Put a halo on friendly beasts. Okay, well, I'm just going to put a sword guy down. Hey, puppy. Rotate. I, I don't think I can when I first summon him. Yeah, the rabbit's dead. Fuck. That was the weirdest attack I've ever seen. Motherfucker has one HP. Heals a friendly unit for three health. Oh, that's nice. Great. Yep, I see it. Do I win? <laughs> I don't like how long everything takes to do. Uh, boredom status. Your health regenerates a little after every battle and by a point it's remote. Okay, cool. Great. Can I leave this? Holy fuck. This is your first battle without a tiny, isn't it? What the fuck? It still matters which beast you choose. After all, they'll be the ones fighting for you. Okay, so I don't have a tiny anymore. Uh, I just can't lose all my characters. What happens if I blow up this barrel? I wonder if it explodes. I guess I'll do... I don't have Rain of Arrows, do I? Should I test? Let's test it. Let's see what's up. Nope. Ow. Okay, he can move all the way to there. Fuck. Definitely want to stay right here. I guess just go to sleep. Hmm. 
I could start beating the fuck out of him. I think I should. I want that four. Sword guy kills him next turn. Oh god. Oh. Shit. Gives double halo to a friendly beast. Heals five health. And no one's that injured. Attacks up two fields well, deals additional damage to heretics. Okay, I double haloed. Oh god, ow. Okay, he's dead. Oh god. Okay, I gotta heal a motherfucker. Let's hear my spear guy, I guess. You're dead, aren't you? Oh! Can I not shoot? I guess just go to sleep here? Fuck, I don't know. Obscured? Oh. Okay, well now I can walk his herb. Stab this guy for five, I guess. What is that? What the fuck? Jesus! That is some crazy AoE. I don't like that. <laughs> Welcome. Would you like some of my invigorating golden drink? I can't seem to get these two. Certainly not. I would never allow myself into these vile libations. I try to impress the public. Plus 50 crowns and plus 10 health. Sword wielding dog, donkey bard, the mighty hare has a mace attack. Is that a snail? A slow yet deadly unit can only attack adjacent fields, devours enemies, and ba- It cost 15 ink. I bought the snail.
Oh god, I gotta climb tower. Okay. Okay, let's just put him there. Okay, I can put a snail right here. Fuck it, let's go. Stab me with his Alright, let's just push him off I Are you kidding me? Attacks object on Jason field devours the target right, I guess I'll just go stand here Put an archer here and I'll start walking him to stand behind my snail. That could be fun. End turn. Pretty sure it's my turn first on chapter three, right? Nope, it's not. <laughs> he just hurt himself? He fucking did. Do I even have the ability to attack? Oh, wait. I just ate. I just ate the boss. I guess I'll take this fox. I steal ink. Hand actions. This game is a lot. Uh, draws a barrel, affects a single. Duh, 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 duh. Focuses an enemy beast to take a nap and skip its turn. And that seems insane. I'll just take that. Talents. Hand actions used by friendly beasts increase their halo by level by one. Grants one drop of living ink for every friendly beast that dies. Friendly beasts gain two health at the beginning of each chapter. I'll just take the healing, I guess. All right, GG's. That's enough of that for now. That's uh, it's just very slow. Supermarket simulator. I mean, it's a good game. I'm not going to say it's not. It's just 